Hey you right guys, Trophy Hunters Joe here and today we are watching and reacting to episode 7 of New Girl Season 5. This is my first episode back in 2024, it's been about 3, maybe 4 weeks since I watched the last episode of New Girl but I remember it really starting to get into a flow of things like Jess is kind of out of the picture for a little bit. We have Megan Fox that has entered the show. Don't know what that's all about. I'm not complaining with that, but that's a, that's a mad... They do have some pretty high-profile uh, guest stars <laughs> with this show, to be fair. Like, the fact they even had Prince alone, that would have been enough, but you know, we've got Megan Fox now. So, episode 7, if you enjoy, make sure to leave a like, as it does help the video and it does help the channel. If you're new subscribers, we have New Girl every single Monday, for the most part. And Patreon will, of course, be linked down below. If you do want the early and uncut reactions to New Girl, then they will be on around episode 17. Oh, no, I, I always forget New Girl's a little bit further, so I think... Patreon would have just finished Season 5, or they'll be very close towards the end of Season 5 by the time this one is on YouTube. But for now, guys, let's do this. Thank I've you. missed uh, these characters. On the spot on the corner? I miss Winston, yeah, more specifically. You know I helped the lady give birth in the kitchen? Oh. Uh, no, 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 dinner's, dinner's ruined. The baby in the old place. Uh, and you stuck okay. it. I knew that <laughs> wasn't going to stop you. <laughs> Jogged past a guy that's offering donkey rides for $50. Fifty. Like that's too much for a donkey ride, right? Yeah, yeah. I know that guy. His name is. His name is Stan. Stan. <laughs> S C A N. His dog's name is Cheerio. Hold on. Right, we'll give you a minute, I guess. It's not a donkey. <laughs> um, it's a dog. Okay. So you get to ride a dog for fifty dollars. That's somehow worse. Cece, make a bed. Oh no, making making beds I genuinely think is maybe the worst thing in the world. I I Just give me the sheep! Yeah. It's that painful. Megan, she's too hot and mysterious. I mean I haven't peed in four days, which is alarming because I've been drinking constantly. Hmm. <laughs> yep, nothing. The fact of the matter is is that she don't want to hang out with us. She's our roommate. But she'd be a straight up discourteous. Tempting, but uh, if I have one margarita, I'll have eight. And if I have eight, end up riding that donkey all the way to Santa Monica. So. It'd be great to watch you ride a donkey. Okay, <laughs> Winston's reaction. <laughs> you hiding toilet paper again? I can't do Did this. Did you see us with the no thanks? How about this? No thanks to your no thanks. Here's what I'm gonna do. <laughs> I'm gonna make her hang out with us. Whether she wants to. Got him. Not. Okay, I'll just oh, walk on in. No. She's back in the kitchen. She's back in the kitchen. Nick, we're making sex. <laughs> Creating sex as a thing. Or play, you tween. You don't just buy a Porsche off the lot and immediately enter in the Grosser Preis von Deutschland. What? The Grosser Preis von Deutschland. Oh, uh, <laughs> whatever that's about. Dragon! Oh, the slowest <laughs> jog ever. We're both running. But yeah, take your time. Who cares? We're roommates now. And in our loft, we do things together. Like a family. Ooh, look, bubbler. <laughs> <laughs> There's a band aid in there. Right oh. In? Yeah, somehow I think Winston doesn't Camilla. care. Oh, it's uh, this actress who's in everything, like 50,000 different things, I think this actress is in. What have we here? Back on the stick, I see. No, no, no. No. Nope. nope. I'm just staying with him and his roommate. I'm about to start binge watching Ken Burns' jazz. Hmm. Oh, Ken Burns's jazz. Woo! I'll call you later. Do that. <laughs> well. Call me. Yeah, I'm going to. Okay. Uh, <laughs> Can't wait. Whatever that is. What is wrong with you? I am hooking up with her. I'm dating her a little bit, but I'm over it and I'm trying to avoid her. What are you telling people I'm here for a month? Megan Fox is hooking up with the character from Buffy. <laughs> And other shows. I have to dump her, and I have never dumped anybody before. I don't know how. I travel so much that I usually just disappear. Hmm, healthy. What makes you think I've been dumped a lot? Please, I read you guys the moment I got there. Nick's deal is, he honest to God might be 50. <laughs> he really might. I've got no privacy, and it has been way, way, way too long since Mama got her biscuits. And the biscuits. Hmm, interesting way to put that. You stick to the pan and get a little brown on the bottom. Hmm. I'm gonna be honest, that went right over my head. Yeah, that... <laughs> they all went over my head, but... The truth of the matter is, is I kind of get it. You know, when we first met, I had to pretend that all kinds of things were wrong with you, just so I wouldn't freak out. So, episode one onwards, basically. All we have to do is find a detail that won't make him spin out. Easy. It'll be the opposite of easy. It will be difficult. Well, we need to do <laughs> something so smart, so nuanced. I wonder if he does this live delivery and everything he does now. Only a genius 
Good to think of it. Regan wears a wig. What? Right, Get right. out of here. The only question is why. Personal, um, lady reasons. I don't want to touch that. <laughs> Fair Regan enough. wears a wig. Told you before. Yeah. Because, uh, lady stuff. Nick probably will buy that. I don't buy it. Nope. Doesn't make sense. Hmm. Failed. I know my boy. <laughs> I know my boy. <laughs> You gotta get busy living or get busy dying. Heard? <laughs> it's gonna get in his head, he's gonna stop believing. What are you doing? What are you doing is the question. What are you doing? Were you just smelling my hair? How is he somehow making it worse? That You know, it doesn't matter, it's Nick. It's a wig. Mm. They have to do really nothing. And now my boy. I'm Camilla. Break up with me. <clears throat> Camilla. Yes, baby, I love you so much. <laughs> we have had uh, a lot of really good times together. And oh I just my god. Doing... Oh my god. Oh my goodness. Oh my god. <laughs> I knew this was coming. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. Uh, oh, you breaking up with me? Why you hate me? Why you hate I me so much? I don't hate you. I don't hate you. Oh my god, you don't. Oh my goodness. So you're not breaking up with me. We're going to have such a happy life I, together. I am. I am breaking up with you. Oh my god, you is breaking up with me. So I don't think you'll go like this. I'm pregnant with your child. That isn't possible. Hmm. Yeah, his name is Delante. We would never name our child that. Yeah, D apostrophe Delante. I can't. I look, I can't do this. Okay. Uh, gonna bail. Yeah, I suck at this. Obviously. Well, you, she did break up with her, so in this scenario. Why don't you just be honest about why you're breaking up with her? I don't know. You're too nasty in bed, Winston, or you remind me of my brother, Winston, or, <laughs> or Winston, you spend too much time in the butterfly house. All uh, right, what which one that links to? If you do it, I will do a 20 minute roommate dinner. Okay, deal. <laughs> 20 minutes and that's it. Thinking. Damn it, Miller! Maybe Winston was right. How well do we know this Reagan character? What are you doing? Sure, he wears a wig. Not a big deal. Or, let oh. me ask you, is it a big deal? Ask yourself, what type of person wears a wig? A bald person? Sure, I'll say so. I guess, yeah, wow. Schmidt has framed photos of himself. Beyonce wears wigs, and you would trust Beyonce with your life. Yeah, I trust Beyonce with my life. Ryder, where's my surfboard? Surfboard? <laughs> surfboard? Bring it on there, wood. I'll be back bringing it on there, wood. We be wow. Boy. Close your eyes, and that actually could just be Beyonce. She's quiet, she pays, she takes care of her room. Her room, that's it. Great thinking. That's why I love you. That's why. Not physically, uh, mm. but as a person. Like, um, it's not sexual. I love you like a mother or a sister or a girlfriend. It's not sexual. I, I don't think any of that needed to be said. And now you're just oh, in a room. He, he's yeah. making this worse. Ribbon. <laughs> so it's face. Oh, these are probably no, Stop. You should not be in here. Picture of a little boy. This woman is like an orange. You peel a layer, there's another layer there. You're thinking of an onion. An orange only has one layer. <laughs> thing. Okay, so I'm gonna spread uh, it back exactly like they found it. Well, it clearly is gonna be me because I'm the only one who can fold. True, true. Schmidt actually volunteered for that. Why would you lie to me? Well, we wouldn't need to lie to you if you would just talk to Reagan instead of hiding out in my room with your cheap Southwestern food. Talk to her? Like a normal human being? Yes, yes. that's exactly what I want oh. you to do. I have nothing in common <laughs> with that woman! Well, what a concept, Nick. And I'm just a mud man from the bowels of Chicago. Let's clean this place up and let's get out of here. She's gonna be home soon. Wait. Oh, what we got? What we got? Oh. We have actually these? found something. Sarah She's a criminal. Susie Shimizu? That's Reagan's face. These are fake IDs. She's on the run. It's a fa it's fake identification. You're damn right it is, Jack. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Look, this is a little bit weird, but I'm sure there's a perfectly reasonable explanation for this. They weren't even that well hidden, so could have just stumbled across them pretty easily. Yeah, it's fake IDs. I'll tell you, con men, grifters. It's all starting to make sense to me. Check this out. Let me break this down for you. Okay. She and her bastard son, <laughs> who she had with the Ohio uh. State professor, go town to town selling, let's say, fake pills. Let's just wow. clean this place up. Let's get out of here. Great theory. Well, that should be true. Put this down. I just so, picked I'll, it up. I'll fold it. You don't know what you're doing. Hey, Reagan, come no, no, You're going to start folding it now. Here. Possum in here. Don't come in here. Because it's... Cece loves this. 
It wasn't that well hidden. Megan wants to break up with me. Oh my god, you're actually doing that. Who oh yeah. Are you? I'm her roommate. Oh, Who so she are said you? Her roommate to break up with me? Now I have no more questions. Well, great. Then I'm out. Blessings. Blessings? <laughs> He's gonna invite her over. You must know how this makes me feel. You've clearly been dumped many times. Why do people keep saying that? She wants to dump me. She should man up and look me in the eye. You know what? She should have, and I told her that. It's the least she could have done. Hey, you're preaching to the choir. Ask me how many times I've been dumped. I don't know. 47 you. times. Bro. Birthday. And out of that 47 times and once on my birthday, oh. do you know what part hurts the most? Getting bailed on. Getting bailed on. 47. And he just continues on with life. Let's go find her. Hell yeah. Ooh, wait, wait, wait. I just thought about it, and that's not a good where idea. Where is she? How do you, how do you know I know where she at? You said your roommates. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Well, he didn't exactly invite her over, but... So, the money. The fake IDs. I have fake IDs because hospitals hate pharmaceutical reps, and it gets me through the door. I carry Canadian mm. cash because I do a lot of business there, and I don't trust banks. Who does? Okay. All right, fine. Smooth. What about this, though? Your son... He looks just like you. That is me. Oof. We all owe you an apology for pretty much everything. I'm sorry that we went through your room. Well, that's not what I'm upset about. I mean, I went through all of your rooms when I first moved in. Excuse Wait. me. That's understandable. But I think that's pretty understandable when you think about it. But the point is, I didn't jump to conclusions. I mean, Nick has a two by four in his room with a nail in it. I didn't assume he was building a human cage. I'm building a tree house. You're doing what? You're building a tree house? <laughs> what? Involved. Why is Cece not involved? We want to be involved. Oh, I'm involved. <laughs> so is Winston. What? Mm -hmm. Everyone's involved in the tree house, but I? Forget about it. Regan, how would you like to build a tree house with me? No. <laughs> How have we got to that? Oh, I feel like we are really off topic here. What I'm trying to say is, why did you just assume that I'm a criminal? Well, because these two are paranoid maniacs. Hmm. Or apparently are building a treehouse together. Maybe it was for you, Schmidt. Look, I'm, I'm only going to be here for a few weeks. There's no reason to get all emotionally involved. Let's just keep it clean, and that way nobody gets upset. I am so oh, upset never mind, right never now. Mind. Uh, let me get ahead of this, Rumi. I did not help out today. Because <laughs> you got ahead of it great there, Winston. Thanks. Yeah, I guess we don't need another coach situation where we're all upset when Megan Fox is leaving. What are you doing here? Cut the crap. Why? You sent him to dump me? Why? No. To dump you? No. Why would I do that? Why would you do that? What the hell, that man? Crazy. Uh, well, why would anyone do that? What's wrong with you? Tell the truth, you sneaky woman. Regan, are you dumping me or not? No. Hmm. Okay. <clears throat> the truth is. The truth is a lie. I'm going to assume. That I'm a criminal. Ah, uh, there it is. Mm. I'm a criminal. You shouldn't be with me. I'm disgusting. She's a criminal. Filthy. Disgusting yeah. crimes. One of the worst human beings I've ever met in my life. And who are you? We're a co-criminal. Co-criminal. We're on the streets together. Okay. From Bangkok to Chicago to here. It's murdering people. <laughs> you had to go all the way, didn't you? And her name is not Reagan. Susie Shimizu. Susie Shimizu. Japanese? Very much so. <clears throat> Very much so. CC, but spelled S I. S I with an accent over the last. Very cool. I, I am spinning out here, Moyle. You gotta help me. Why don't you go spin all the way over to your tree house? Schmidt knows about the tree house. Okay, what the hell is going on? <laughs> Winston, check for a wire. She could be a rat. Stop it. This isn't real. You're telling us we're not a Japanese crime I mean, it family? could. Right. <laughs> it could be real. Seriously, just stop failing. It has to be. This has to be the moment, Reagan. This isn't working out. There but we I think go. That it's my fault. Because I don't let people in. I'm sorry. I think that you deserve a lot better than that. A lot better than that, what was just conjured up, maybe. I know that wasn't easy for you. Oh, there you go. Easy peasy. Well, I still have my blue sweater. Yes. Oh, no, no, uh, it's right in my room right here, the first door. Okay. Thanks. What? Oh, no. That's nice. Telling the truth works. Yeah, dead. Bravo. Oh, oh, Winston knew. Yeah, it's the old I left my sweater trick. <laughs> Let me tell you something, folks. I've played that song before. Okay. Right, well, this obviously turned out to be a huge disaster, but thank you. I'm proud of you. All of you. I mean, you guys have a... The Winston and Reagan friendship that we all need. Found and you helped me lie to a psychotic woman who is now destroying all of my stuff. 
anything to help. That's kind of what we do. That's how we roll. <laughs> how do you think she's taking it? <laughs> Good joke. So come on, let's try Beans. It's working. <laughs> It kind of works a little bit. It's horrendous, but I guess it works. Nick! What? You still can't eat in front of Reagan? This has nothing to do with Reagan. I've just gotten used to eating in here. It's cozy. He's got Stockholm Syndrome. <laughs> ah, she's him. What? I like the way you eat a burrito. Okay. What? I love him. That was great. What a great episode to come back to. 74%. You know what? I guess it kind of slightly weaker than last week's episode. What? Missing Jess because I don't like Reagan. The rest of the cast is fine, but points for Winston. Yeah, that's good. Um, right. <laughs> I don't know. I'm having more fun with this now that Jess is gone for a little bit. Right, Clea Duvall. That was Clea? Clea? I don't know how you say her name. Let's see, because I've definitely seen her in quite a few things. I'll check now. It's been like Better Call Saul. That was, she was in season one of that. Argo. Good film. New Girl, American Horror Story, that was the other thing, uh, Zodiac, which are Heroes, was she a detective in Heroes or something like that? Uh, Grey's Anatomy, The Grudge, she was in the flashbacks for The Grudge, so I did that recently, Girl Interrupted, great film, She's All That, watched that recently, Buffy, which we mentioned, and then a ton of other stuff, like, wow. <laughs> Quite the plethora of shows, even ones I would just react to, so that's that's pretty cool. But, yeah, good to see her in an episode, actually. Fun episode. Comedy was really on point this episode. Uh, Storyline-wise, it wasn't that deep. It was just trying to learn more, a little bit more about Reagan and her trying to dump uh, this character and Nick being all over the place. But I thought the comedy was really on point with this one, so I'm happy. Uh, I'm... When do we guess? Well, you guys already know, obviously. I'm going to try and guess when Jess comes back. Probably after the mid-season finale. So I'm going to go when... If they have a mid-season finale. I don't know if they took a break. Let me... February, February, March, 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 April, April. Okay, they don't have a mid-season finale. So I'm just going to have to take a guess here. Let's go episode... Let's go halfway anyway. Episode... 11 is when Jess comes back. That's my guess. Because that's halfway through the season and then probably, I don't know, we'll see. Maybe it'll be next season, who knows. But rating-wise, we'll go 7.7 7 out of 10. I would give it an 8 if the story, I guess, was a bit more in-depth. Literally just the comedy was so good with this episode, which is why it has quite a high rating for me. But thanks for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Let me know if you thought the episode down below in the comments. And I'll see you next time for episode 8. Until then, take care. Peace.